Erie News Now Sunrise, 624 on your Friday morning. It's back to school week here on uh, Erie News Now Sunrise. And of course, it wouldn't be a trip back to school without getting that back to school <laughs> look. And that usually involves a haircut. And a guy who has uh, cut probably more back to school haircuts than anybody in Erie is this man, Michael I Hooks. I hesitate to even throw out a number. How many kids do you think you've cut hair on? Tens of thousands <laughs> over the years. Wow. Been doing okay. this for about 20 years. Yeah, wow. I'll tell that Michael Making Lives Better uh, Foundation that you have uh, you know, started again so many years ago. But now uh, talk about what you're going to be doing uh, moving forward this year for kids to get that back to school cut. Well, the game plan is to uh, host a free haircut day this Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 5 at the Booker T. Washington Center. Okay. okay. But the, the ultimate goal is to be able to provide free haircuts throughout the whole school year. So we're partnering with the three community centers. That would be the uh, Martin Luther King Center, the John F. Kennedy Center, and, and of course the Booker T. Washington Center to be able to... Um, to provide uh, free haircuts throughout the school year for That's kids. Fantastic. Michael, we got Kara's, or excuse me, we got uh, Tracy's little guy Grady right here. And when you're cutting uh, hairs, <laughs> his hairs like this, what inspired you to kind of start the effort at all those years ago? Well, realistically, um, uh, uh, we believe if, if you look good, you feel good. Yeah, sure. And yeah. if you feel good, you, you do good. Okay. Get right off on the right foot as yes, you go back to yes, school. Yes, it's very important. Um, you know, uh, starting school can be intimidating for some, sure. mm -hmm. and then, then not just looking good. You know, I, I always felt like looking good helps that process out. Yeah, I love that. I love that. And I love that you're giving back to the community in the best way that you know how. Yeah, yeah it's important that we all just find our little, uh, our little <laughs> niche and, and, and play a role in helping, um, helping this Erie community, which is a wonderful community. Um, just be the best that it can. I Michael, one that. of the things I noticed when we were looking at the video from some of the past haircut events, the smiles on the kids' faces after they get after they get that cut from you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some, sometimes, uh, you know, like I said, it could be a little intimidating for some uh, early on, but over the years they come <laughs> back year after year after year and they get to know us and they just love the process. That's fantastic. So we're going to cut this little guy's hair, but uh, it's going to take us a little, how long does it take you to give a haircut? Uh, it could be pretty quick or it could be pretty long. <laughs> really? Depending on the kid. See, I think that's interesting. So Grady is, Grady's my five-year-old. He's starting kindergarten this year. So we want him to look good and feel good as he goes into his first day of school uh, ever. Hey, um, hey. <laughs> but you know, as a parent standing by, it's a little nerve-wracking, you know, because you always want your kid to feel their best. Yeah, yeah, it's very important for the barber to, uh, to, to make everyone feel comfortable. Yeah. So. Yeah, and you do a good job of that. It's got to feel good when you see those smiles yeah, at the that's, end. That's always been our number one goal. So <laughs> Again, Michael, the specifics of the uh, haircut opportunity uh, this weekend. Yes, we're going to be at the Booger T. Washington this Saturday and Sunday uh, from 12 to 5. Okay. It's, it's a lot of other events going on throughout the city, so we just want to just play our little part mm -hmm. and just... Uh, uh, just, just wrap everything up before school starts yeah. next week. Sort of while you're out and about, stop by, get a haircut, and get and ready a backpack for... backpack with, with school supplies. Oh, I love excellent. that. Well, again, it'll happen at the Booker T. Washington Center this weekend. Michael Hooks, thanks so much for stopping by. Oh, and thanks so welcome. much for their, everything that you've done for the community over the oh, past 20 years. You're very welcome. So. Much appreciated. All right, Erie News.